Hello, my lovely describers. Today we're playing The Walking Dead. So, I found this cool glitch, and I'll show you guys how to do it soon, but not now. So, I have um, one of the things installed, and it says, it says I bought the season pass, but I actually didn't. So, this is what happened. I, I found a glitch where I can download the map. Not download the map, but get it for free. So we're going to be playing The Walking Dead today. Where's my trippy? Let's play the first one. I remember the first time when I played, wait, played one of the episodes. I played the one where I get my hand dropped off, I think. But that was a long time ago. fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the... I didn't do it. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. Mm. This guy what looks like a uh, Pentagon one. Ooh. Here, All cars have to keep on the lookout for how do you want to be in the area. Follows your case a little bit. You being a Macon boy and all. You're from Macon then? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. Always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame that is. Hell, the whole family so is in regular at your it, folks' drugstore right in downtown. Like I don't. Still yeah. there? Sure is. Good. Be advised, uh, medical personnel on route to Hartsfield, various tents. Any of that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention, and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on a sixth year. Meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Sure. <laughs> I, I'm like, well, you mean you don't know what to say. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. Riot in progress. All officers are available. 47217. You'll have to learn to stop worrying about that things you good. can't control. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst. Oh, no, he wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't button? do it. Yeah, he was an older I'm fella. Big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. He just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and yeah. snotting all over right where you're all sitting. officers are available for he coming to one. Hmm. And before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. And I tell him he's got to stop. But that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. 
mama. It's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So did he do it? Maybe he was innocent. Did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. Oh, he sits no. in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. Oh, no, so it goes to show. People will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. Hmm. Well, I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit yeah. less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. Fucking try! This other time. Wow. Why didn't you look? What about officer? What's to keep your eye on the body, man? No games, no. I'm also going to try to talk. Whoa. Oh, what happened? So I'm going to say, um, so I just want to say, I will be playing the second game and hopefully the third game soon. Because I know, I really played the second one, and I played, I had all of it. I like how I have all of the, um, the season twos. Like, I played all of the season two episode, and I know what to do. But I'm not going to read the surprise for you, you guys probably watched it or so. But you guys haven't been welcome to the Captain Dead Life. Ah! So I'm gonna be trying. Ooh, here we go. So I'm gonna be trying to talk when nobody's talking. Because then we can make horrible audio. Now we're gonna have all this Walking Dead gameplay going on, and we're gonna do all this stuff. I really want to get like this whole episode done because I don't want to have to keep on playing this one because this was the most boring one. Help! Go get someone! There's yes, been a shooting!
Bell clumsy Lee. I'm gonna probably just call this video um The Walking Dead. Uh episode that one. Clumsy Lee. I'm right back. Hey Born Born, look what I found. Hey what you got there, Freddy? I think you just know his phone. <laughs> okay, so you shouldn't you give give that back to him? I don't know. <laughs> Should I? Or should we play a bit of this game? Yeah, let's play a bit of this game. Okay. Um, wait, he was recording a video? Oh, um. Hi, everybody! I'm Funtime Freddy! Hey, you guys must have heard what I said. Do not tell Noah. Ooh, I'm gonna ask Noah if I can play the next part of this. Because it does look fun. Well, you are, um, just, like, playing for a bit, right, Frontime Freddy? Yeah, of course, Bon Bon. You don't really let me have any fun. This place has been ransacked. Just about anything well, worthwhile is gone. His phone. So? He just, he wouldn't mind. Hey, where's my phone? Uh. Frontime Freddy! Put it somewhere where he can't find it. I don't want to get in trouble. Bon Bon, just relax. He wouldn't have find his inside in his in his closet. Oops. Ooh, well, hello, handsome. Who are you? Mm. I don't even bound outside the world. This one's how it looks. I guess he know what has. I don't know. Ooh, what we got here. Looks like a phone. Let's, let's look at it. Maybe okay, fun time for you. Oh, you, you have a message? Let's check it out. Okay. <laughs> Three new messages. Let's try to solve Vegas. Message quick. one left at 5:43 p.m. Hey Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. 
Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. And anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before the spring break. Message two. Left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Marietta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message three. Left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. Hello? You need to be quiet. Well, how come, though, girl? Oh, I guess the boo. I'm not a monster. Good. Yeah, but you're not, but we are. Haha. <laughs> Yes. I don't know where anybody is. How old are you? I'm, uh, 37. Okay. Where are your parents? Yeah, where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. Oh, you are? Where? I can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? Time. I can see you through the window. was a monster. Uh, I think so, too. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. Oh, no. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but... 
but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. Okay, whoever been with the phone, you guys better get back. Let's go. Stay close to me. What if no one finds us? Part. Oh man, I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot this night. <clears throat> oh, hey guys, do you guys need some help? What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Okay. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Well, for a second, you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. What are you doing? What are you doing? Trying to get home. This neighborhood's a disaster. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. Hi, Judd. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... Just some guy. <laughs> some uh, guy? Yeah. yeah. She's alone? Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. What do you want to do? I... Your monster's coming. We gotta go. Lee, quick. Let's go. Funtime electronics. Oh, Joyce, where is Funtime with Foxy? Oh, please don't tell me she's on the roof because for, even though she's a like, kind of mango, she likes to be on top of the roof. Hold on, let me check on top of myself. No, she's not there. Funtime Freddy, do you know where um, is Funtime Foxy? Uh, oh, you really have to hit us that hard. Hey, you took my phone. Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. And don't, and my guys, don't worry, I didn't get them. them. No sweat, yes, man. you did. I'll catch you tomorrow Shh, night. Be quiet. It was nice to Fine, meet I you did both. eat them. Okay, so fun time, Foxy. I don't really know. 
She could be in her pirate cove though area. Oh no, no. I don't know. Oh wait, pirate Thank cove? God you're okay. Yeah, you been there? I was worried it'd be bad here too. Kinda. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. He's trying to back at the old place. I was cold as fuck this area. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. Okay, guys, we got. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He's, well, just some guy who found her alone. Honey, do you know who this man is? Yes. Okay, then. Well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. Thanks, man. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. It hurts like hell. I bet it does. What did you say your name was? It's Lee. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. Like Herschel. How'd this happen? Car accident. That's so... Where were you headed before the car accident? I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about on the road. Who are you with, the girl? I was with a police officer. He was giving me a ride. Awful nice of him. <laughs> An awful nice guy. House is full up with mine. We got another displaced family of three sleeping in the barn. Oh, you and your daughter are welcome to rest there. When we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is I mean, yet. Face on there. I wouldn't worry too much. We're pretty far from the city. Seems like that's where it's the worst. Yeah. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come on. Tell him what you saw out there, man. Chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks, man. Thanks. Well, if your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. Oh, God. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Uh, uh, okay, uh, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. We'll probably Come get tomorrow, episode, which uh, way you think you're headed? Part two or episode two? Towards making, I suppose. Wait, no, part two. I'm out. I'm made today, too. All right, then. Thanks, man. Really helpful. And, and I will know if the bomb was like fun time for you. It smells like episode two. And then it's up to him who's next. I know what it smells like.